Today's video is sponsored by Dizel Services, so make sure you do check them out. The links will be down below in the description. So they do got way cheaper deals than what Rockstar will ever offer. So make sure you do check them out. And the first purchase, make sure you do use code Frozzy so you get 5% off. Alrighty guys, so now in today's GTA 5 online video, I'll be showing you how to drive an invisible car on GTA 5 online like you guys saw in the thumbnail. Now before we start today's video off, I am telling you that I am doing a modded account giveaway. So if you guys do want to enter, here's the way to enter on screen. So first, go ahead and subscribe. Second, turn post notifications on. Third, like today's video. Fourth, watch the whole video. And lastly, all you want to do is just go ahead and follow my Instagram, which is Frozzy Glitches. Now, as soon as you follow my Instagram, just go ahead and message me saying you've done all the steps, and I'll say you've entered the giveaway. Easy as that. So let's go ahead and get straight into this GTA 5 online glitch on how to drive an invisible car. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is just go ahead and make your way to your arcade near the garage. And just go ahead and put your spawn location on last location. Now you guys see, mine's on last location right now. And just to save it, we're just going to go ahead and change our outfit. Alright, so now it's saved. So, what you want to do from here after you have your spawn location near your arcade, just go ahead, go to pause, go online, go to creator, and go ahead and start it up. Now, in order to have this glitch completed, you will need a Night Shark or a Stromberg. So, do keep that in mind. You will need one of those vehicles. So, as soon as we let into creator here, what we're going to do. Let's go ahead, hover over, exit to GTA 5, and then we're going to go to pause, and go to online, and hover over go, after you hit play GTA 5 online. Now as soon as you're hovering over go, just go ahead, spam X or A, depending on what console you're on, and it should say you're quitting creator on the bottom right, and then it should say later on, if you're loading into GTA 5 online. So, just go ahead, keep on spamming X or A until it says you're loading into GTA 5 online. We're going to go ahead and spam X right now. Just keep on spamming. And there we go. Now it says GTA 5. So I'll go ahead and meet back with you guys when we spawn back near our arcade. Alright, now, as soon as we spawn back in, we're going to go ahead and call in our Night Shark or Stromberg. So you guys see I've got the Stromberg right here. And we're just going to enter the arcade garage. So let's go ahead and do this. Now we'll throw this into a black screen for about maybe. A minute or two, so I've got to be back with you guys when we spawn back outside with the Stromberg. Alright, so I spawned us right back outside. As you guys see, we're invisible. Now, your guys are should appear after about maybe 5 to 10 seconds. And as you guys see, we're driving with an invisible car. Easy as that. Now, you guys can also shoot the rockets and everything, as you guys see. And yeah, you can also drive through pedestrian vehicles, which makes this a lot better. Yeah, so that's how you guys drive an invisible car on GTA 5 and 9 using the Stromberg or the Night Shark after the recent patch 1.51. And there you guys have your trolling glitch for your friends and everything else. And yeah, so this has been your boy Fonzie back in another GTA 5 online video to help you guys out. I hope you guys liked this video, and I'm out. Peace. Peace.